Good morning. It's another great morning. I got up early, got work done already, and I think I'm gonna go to the beach by myself again. Uh, I never spent so much alone time uh, with myself, uh, but I'm gonna go work on a video and like write it out at the beach while I work on my tan, and maybe I'll go see some stingrays today. Uh, Allie and Charles got here last night. Um, obviously, they're probably settling in. I talked to Allie last night, but maybe they'll call me this week and I'll be able to see them. I got Charles a really cute present. I think he's really gonna like it. Uh, but I don't want to show you, just in case one of them watches the vlog. It is another beautiful day at the beach. Uh, today there is also the purple flag, which means uh, that the lifeguard stand, which means hazardous marine life, which is probably the stingrays. But there's also a yellow flag, which I've never seen before. So I'm not sure what that means exactly. I'm gonna have to go investigate. But I'm about to go for a run. Uh, and then I'm probably gonna wanna jump in the water because it's really hot. Surprise, surprise, it's really hot out in Florida. Man, that was a really tough run. It is so different to run barefoot. Uh, like, it works different muscles. You're using, like, more of the front of your foot than your heel. And I got blisters on my toes already just from, like, friction they're not used to. Uh, but it was so pretty. I love running on the beach. I definitely need to go in the water. Okay, I totally saw a bunch of stingrays when I was swimming. I didn't chicken out at all. I went in, I saw about eight. There were some small ones, a really big one, and they were covered in sand, and they were just swimming around, and they camouflaged really well, so I did get a little afraid. Um, and when I, I went like for a swim, and I took my feet off the ground, and I was scared to put them back down because I didn't want to step on one. Hopefully I got it, some footage of it on the GoPro. I chased it, but I think I scared it away. I always make sure to clean my camera after going to the beach. So I have this cool little tool with a brush on it. And a little end that has a lens cleaning cloth on it. So I looked up what the lifeguard flag colors meant. And there was, well that looks blue, but in real life it's purple. Uh, dangerous marine life, like I saw. And the yellow just means medium hazards. I don't know if there was riptides. It also says yellow sign with black borders means sharks, stingrays, or jellyfish, which I saw a ton of jellyfish too. There's all kinds of critters in the ocean. Uh, I talked to the roommates last night on Skype, and I was telling them that I went in the water while there were stingrays, and I went by myself. And they're like, die! And uh, Sam was making fun of me because lifeguards have flags to warn you about dangerous marine life. He's like, we don't even have flags like that in California. Like, nothing's gonna get you. So they really want me to go in the water when I get back. So I have to tell you guys something gross. Remember when Kevin and I went rock climbing? I had to rent shoes because I didn't have any of my own. And when I took the shoes off, they smelled so bad. And I, I know it wasn't from my feet because they smelled when I got them, but also my socks really, really smelled. And I'm not gonna say my feet have never smelled before. They smell a lot when I was in cross country because I had running shoes on all the time. So I know what my feet smell like, and I know when they smell. And normally I'm just in flip flops now and they don't smell anymore. So I had some stranger's smelly feet smell on my feet, so I threw the socks away. I don't know if that grosses you guys out, but that like really grossed me out. And so, after wearing those shoes, I took my socks off and then wore my flip-flops home. And recently I smelled my flip-flops and they smell like those climbing shoes. And it really is freaking me out. So, I got some baking soda. I don't know if you guys know this trick, you probably already know. But uh, when I used to have smelly shoes in cross country, I would do this. But if you just put baking soda in or on your shoes uh, and leave it there for like a day, it soaks the smell right up. So I bought a little tiny, it's like less than a dollar to buy this stuff. I'm just going to cover my shoes in it and let them sit in this bag for a day. And get that stranger's smelly feet off of them. Mom's watching my vlog. <laughs> <laughs> we just got done shooting food with Dottie, and my mom made banana bread, and it's cooking right now, and it smells so good. I, you guys should, I don't know, I think most people know how to make banana bread, but I didn't know, and it's super easy. 
and delicious. All right, my mom took me out to dinner and we just had some delicious snapper and mom picked the dessert <laughs> and it was, it's, what's it? Three creme, or it's, creme brulees. Um, lemon, yeah. green tea, and vanilla. Three little mini creme brulees, creme brulees. for our girls' dinner. Sorry, Cory and Dad. <laughs> Check it out, fresh banana bread. I'll be having that for breakfast tomorrow. I can still smell it through the bag and it smells, whoops, rolled it over. <laughs> It smells delicious. It looks like my mom had a piece already. I'm really excited for that. Um, yeah, and I made an extra one for Charles and Allie if they want it. I tweeted them, uh, this one's got your name on it if you guys want it, and Charles gave me back, yum, so I think they might want some. Hey, Kev. Hi. <laughs> Will you show the viewers your little masterpiece? That is a drawing of Kevin that he did on the mirror. Can you bring me? Oh, is that as close as I can get? Yeah, pretty much. Oh my gosh, I really wish I could see that in real life. 